Please listen to the story of a PhD sister Susan Carland, from Australia, on the eve of the new year, when he was 17 years, Susan Carland makes some resolutions, and one of them is to find out about other religions, in addition to the embrace of Christianity Baptists since childhood. At that time, the religion of Islam, was not included in the priorities of religion, who wants Susan to learn, let alone think about marrying a Muslim. But two years later, at age 19, she became a Muslim. He spoke two sentences of the creed of his own accord, without the influence of anyone, including the influence of a man, then Susan's mother's reaction to seeing his daughter converted to Islam. One night, Susan's mother said that he made pork slices for dinner. Tonight was the first time Susan's mother knew, her daughter had become a Muslim. Susan's mother called her a victims of Islam, but mother gave me a hug, though he was crying, said Susan. A few days later, she decided instead to wear the hijab. During the eight years of Islam, relations with his mother Susan were experiencing hard times. But now their relationship began to improve. Her mother even bought her scarf, so often and sent gifts to children during Eid al-Fitr. I love Islam and Muslims, without a doubt. People who are most admirable, and most inspiring, I have ever come across is the Muslims and it helps me not to withdraw completely from society," said Susan. Susan married a Muslim man in February 2002. He held his wedding at the Melbourne Zoo. Her husband was a lawyer named Waleed Ali, who also serves on the executive board of the Islamic Council of Victoria. Ali, an Egyptian Muslim, of descent who was born in Australia was also a lecturer at Monash University and worked at the Global Terrorism Research Center. When I embraced Islam, I and Waleed have not met, I'm still alone. We decided to get married a few years after I became a Muslim, said Susan. Asked about his spiritual journey, after converting to Islam, she revealed, that she felt intellectual freedom. I started to go to the Muslim chat rooms, on the internet and I am acquainted and established communication, with several Muslim women, who were studying at my university. They patiently answered my questions, said Susan. Susan completed her studies up to the PhD level. He did research, on the challenges facing women, in leadership problems seasons. Susan is now a lecturer, and tutor at the School of Political, and Social Inquiry at Monash University, Melbourne. Australia, for the field of gender studies, youth, and the sociology of religion. He continued, when I let the religion speak, for itself through its traditions, through the clergy and the sacred text, to resist what is written by journalists at the tabloids, and the appalling behavior of Muslims, I find that Islam is a religion of peace, egalitarian, socially just and a beautiful balance between the spiritual and intellectual. Susan preaches Islam by making a Salam Cafe television program that aired nationally on the Australian television network. Thanks for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe, like, comment and share.